I'm Russell Mogridge, I'm Director and Head of Transactional Agency at Hughes Ellard. Overall trend for 2015 has been a steady take up of industrial and logistics space, although actual take up figures for 2015 are lower than 2014. But for 2016, I can see that expanding and certainly maintaining the gradual take up that we're seeing. Slowdown in industrial take up this uh, 2015 has been predominantly because there's been a lack of uh, stock available to let off for sale. What we've had available has really been the leftovers of industrial estates that were developed in 2006 and 2007, principally in the 5,000 to 20,000 square foot range. On the M27 corridor we're seeing logistics businesses taking space as well as manufacturers, particularly in the marine sector and electronics and aviation. Demand is outstripping supply at the moment, for sure, and we're seeing rental growth and incentives reducing. Uh, we have broken the eight pound per square foot barrier. There was a deal at Nursling in Southampton at eight pound per square foot to DFS recently. Certainly with the recovering economy, we've seen businesses now planning for growth, and that's where the demand really is coming from. Businesses with break options or lease expiries within 12 months are now planning for their growth and trying to find buildings, but sadly, they are struggling. In 2016, we will see completions of some of the spec schemes, uh, such as the ones in Chichester and Leon Solent, which is great news. And we're busy trying to find sites now for active developers in our area. We really would like to see some development in Southampton, Hedge End, and Fairham at Sessionsworth. In terms of uh, new development starts, there are some in the pipeline over in Nursling in Southampton and also Chandler's Ford. One of the issues we've got is land allocations for industrial and warehouse space. A lot of local authorities have been uh, assessing uh, land allocations. A lot of land going for residential, we've seen that in the office sector. And so we could do with more sites being allocated for employment use which will help developers identify those sites and bring them forward for development. We are looking at least 24 months away in that regard. <music> 2016, really excited. I can see rental growth, capital values growing. Institutions and funds are going to be making more inquiries to us and backing developers. We just need to find sites for them to build on.